Hey guys, my name is Chaotic, and in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, I'm going to be discussing some leaked information relating to the Heist DLC, which will be released to Grand Theft Auto 5 Online on the 23rd of December 2014, and it will be available for all four consoles. So anyway, without any further hesitation, let's get straight into the video. So first of all, allow me to make myself very clear, as of right now, Rockstar have not confirmed or announced any information regarding the Heist DLC. All of the information has been leaked by a very reliable source, this source being Nelex Mods, and there will of course be a link in the video description to the original source where you guys can check out this information for yourselves. So as you can see being displayed in the video right now is the huge list of features which will be included in the Heist DLC. So let's go through the entire feature list and discuss each feature which will be included in the Heist DLC. But first, as you can see at the top of the feature list, there is a brief description which states we have compiled a feature list for the Heist DLC due on December 23rd, 2014. These features, items and functions have been analysed and confirmed via the developer versions of the relevant content and the code associated with it. Here is a list of our compiled notes. So starting from the top of the list, we have a Heist planning board layout update which will be available for both high-end apartment interiors. This will be available across all platforms. Moving down, we have a brand new Heist selection menu featuring its own social club based leaderboard and music options showing the list of uncompleted Heist missions. This will also be available across all platforms. Next on the list, we have a staggering 34 texture modifications to four different locations. This will also be available across all platforms, but the texture detail is improved on current generation. There is going to be a total of six heist missions in four unique locations as well as five cops and crooks missions also in four unique locations. Over the past few months there have been many modding issues on GTA 5 so Rockstar has improved the anti-cheat methods with some code of this included in the DLC but not directly associated with the heist feature itself. There is also going to be a total of three brand new vehicles coming to Grand Theft Auto 5 online in this DLC but as of right now they have not been identified. There is going to be a brand new apartment with CCTV functions that also have two AI characters in your apartment running them. Next we have three brand new heist themed clothing items but as of right now these are yet to be identified. There will be two cops and crooks themed masks but these will only be available on next generation consoles. BZ gas can now be purchased from the ammunition store but can only be used in heist missions. There will be five new hairstyles and two new contact lenses both of these are yet to be identified. There will be additional matchmaking for heist missions between crews, and there will also be a new phone contact named Jeff. My name is Jeff. Last generation players will have the option to email other crew members about your planned heist missions. Whoever emails a heist plan will be the leader of the operation. But current generation players will have the option to email other crew members about your planned heist mission and have the ability to print out those in your apartment and store them in your document. All players will have the ability to use their heist planning board in order to select a location and there are also going to be four new audio files relating to the heist missions. These have been identified as an alarm bell, the sound of a vault opening, sirens and a background track. So there we have it guys, they were all of the known features which will be included in the Heist DLC when it's released to GTA 5 Online on the 23rd of December 2014. As previously mentioned, all of the information in today's video has come from a very reliable source known as Nelex Mods. There will be links in the video description to the original source and Nelex Mods Twitter page. So anyway guys, that is all I have for this video, but I do hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you guys could take a few seconds out of your day to click the like button, it would help me out a lot and it's also greatly appreciated. Also be sure to leave a comment on this video and tell me what you thought. And if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel already, I would recommend that you do because I upload all the latest and the greatest Grand Theft Auto 5 content. So anyway guys, thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time.